Yo, what's going on YouTube? This is the Aussie Tex, and my goal is to bring you tips and tricks that you might not have heard in any other guides. This one's all about grenades and how you can use them differently and more effectively to get more PMC kills and get your grenadier done quicker. So a lot of PMCs already know the fact that every single grenade has a different explosion time from the Vox 25 being 2.5, Vox 17 being uh, 3, F1 and RGD being 3.5 and the M67 being 5 seconds. But a lot of people don't know that every single grenade actually has a different roll pattern when it hits the ground. So for example, if we grab a couple of Vogue 17s here, and we have a PMC pinned into the right hand side here, what can, we can do is use a Vogue 17. And the Vogue 17 has a natural roll around to the right hand side. And what that allows you to do is actually place your need in and around the corner. Just like that. Now, when we have a look at the F1 grenade, the F1 grenade has a natural roll to the left-hand side. So if you've got a PMC pinned into the left, on a box, around a corner, you can use that knowledge to actually roll your nades into the PMCs rather than try to bank them off the back of walls or slow lob them and that type of thing. So we've got our RGDs and our M67s here. And with the RGDs, what we're gonna be able to do is it rolls about 10 to 15 meters after it hits the ground. So what that means is if we have someone pinned in behind this box here on the left-hand side, what we can do is just land it a little bit short. That's just gonna roll up there and land just behind that box. And you're gonna be able to get, use that knowledge to actually roll your nades into PMCs a lot better. Now the M67 itself, it has the most spherical shape for one. It's the lightest grenade, you can throw it the farthest, and it also has the five second timer. So what that means is that, for example, if someone's up the back of that corridor, you can literally just throw an M67, that mother is gonna roll all the way out there, it's hit that wall. That's how far it can roll. So once, once it actually hits the ground, it rolls quite a distance. So that means that if you, for example, had the same thing and you've got someone pinned down there, you could throw this a lot shorter and that's going to literally get into that same spot. And if we did, did the same thing with an F1 and we rolled that into the left, just having that little bit of knowledge in your back pocket can really help you actually unseat some PMCs that are chilling behind covers, putting their arm back on, putting their legs back on. It's not as easy as it used to be when you used to be able to just throw out the nade without actually having to pull it out and unpin it anymore. But I hope this is a tip that's really gonna help you get more PMC kills and get more Grenadier kills quicker. So if this guide helped you at all, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. We're trying to showcase tips here that you might not have seen in other guides, but you kind of learn over wipes of experience. So like I said, if you like this and you've learned something today, share these videos with your friends. I'll catch you in the next one.